Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will be sharing my IBM interview experience with you. So, this interview was basically for 2022 batch. I got selected in IBM. So, I will share the whole interview process. What are all different rounds involved, I will share with you. Please watch the video from beginning to ending. I will be explaining all the details of all rounds. And also note that this interview experience was for Associate System Engineer role. So, without any further delay, let's get into the details. So once you successfully submitted your application, you will be getting a mail like this. You have successfully submitted the application. Here I applied for associate system engineer role and this was on campus hiring. So once they are okay with your profile, you will be getting a mail like this where all the details of all rounds will be informed to you in this mail. And all the rounds will be elimination rounds. Total there will be 4 rounds. First round will be coding assessment and second round will be Cognitive Ability Assessment and third round will be English Language Test and fourth round will be an interview round. In this mail, they will be explaining details of each and every round. And in this mail itself, they will provide the date and time slot of when will each round will be. So coming to the first round, as you already discussed, it will be a coding round. In this coding round, you will be given only one question. Your test will be in hacker rank platform and you will be given one hour of time. In that one hour time slot, you will have to solve that one question. So some of our friends also qualified for next round even though they haven't completed full coding question. So even few test cases were passed also, they were qualified for next round. So don't give up on this coding question, try as much as you can. And also note that this coding question will be not too much hard, it will be of medium level. So you can surely do it if you have basic programming knowledge and basic problem solving skills. So one example for this round will be like uh, validating a password. Like we have to check the password will be valid or not based on the given conditions. Like this, the questions will be easy only. So mainly we have to focus on the test cases and you can practice similar type of problems. And results will be given very fastly. Maybe next day you will get the results. Upon successfully clearing this coding assessment, you will be qualified for next round. And before proceeding for next round, IBM will send a mail like asking for few details like if you are having disability like that. They will send a form regarding few additional details. We can complete that form. Next round will be your cognitive ability assessment. In this round, they will be sending you a meeting link in which you have to join that link and show your ID proof there. After successful ID verification only, you will get the assessment link to your mail. So this will be like gaming round. Duration will be around 30 minutes. In this, you will be having total 6 logical and mathematical games. They will be very fun and simple. Make sure you have a good internet connectivity while playing this game, then it will be very easy for you. You will be having like moving the marble from one place to other in short distance. Gridlock game like uh, filling the given area with the puzzles and resemblance, which means that uh, they will give an image and you have to and again remake that image like uh, whatever degrees they have mentioned, like in 180 degrees and 90 degrees. And some games on mathematics like you have to pop some bubbles given on the given number. For example, they have given 6, then you have to pop a bubble seeing 2 into 3. So, it, very simple mathematics. And similarly, you have to choose like greater than, less than or equal to like that. that. Now, I will share just basic details that are involved. And in next video, I will share full details of this round. I will make a more detailed and separate video for this cognitive ability assessment round. Not only for this, for each round, I'll make another separate video. What are all the questions involved in that round? I'll make a video on it. And the results will be calculated at this part only. If you successfully cleared that cognitive ability assessment, then you will be having English language assessment test. Link will be triggered to your mail automatically once you cleared that round. If you have any doubts whether your link was triggered or not, uh, you can contact the proctor while in the cognitive ability assessment round. And coming to this English assessment round, it will be around 10 minutes and it will be having three sections based on general English, simple English and you have to answer as many questions as you can. There will be negative marking here. So only if you know the answer then only attempt that question or else you can skip the question like there will be a question mark option you can click on that and it will be moved to next question and you can attempt as many questions as you can in that given period of time. And again I am saying this will be very easy round so there will be negative marking so don't go in a hurry and keep all the answers attempt only the questions that you are confident on and once you clear this round next round will be your interview this was the final round only one interview round 
is this round will be around 20 to 25 minutes i'll make a separate video on this interview round what are all the questions involved in this round then like mostly simple questions like uh, self intro and about projects some questions on python questions on python because i mentioned i was confident on python language so whatever language you are confident on you can mention that so the interviewer asked a few technical questions on that python and few general hr questions also asked anyway it will be very easy interview only not too difficult i'll make a separate video on this round also so once if you cleared that interview round ibm sent results to our training and placement cell and later on finally we have received expression of interest mail this was like whether you are interested to join the company or not and finally they will generate offer letter based on your option selected this is about the all the rounds that are involved in ibm interview process guys again i'll make a detailed video for each round until then please subscribe to my channel all the best